You want me when you need me, want me be a trophy, yeah. yeah. Wifey in the kitchen whipping macaroni, yeah. Uh, Not your homie, but you want me home alone, yeah. yeah. Call your celly, yeah, you don't pick up your phone, yeah. Let's go. Tap me, I'm spicy, your friends don't like me. Cause they pop bottles that don't entice me. This is not a threat, boo, I'm just enlightening. Turn your speakers up so you can hear me nicely. I think he wanna wipe. I'm starting the video. Late as crap today, it's like 3.32. I was just chilling around, laying around the bed, getting some business done, getting some dumb stuff done for the site. I uploaded a blog, so you can check that out. I will link it in the description down below. Um, I'm not really focused on views anymore at this point. I just want to just get videos. I like making videos. I like, you know, making people laugh. Um, and I like basically showing my daily life. So I may vlog today. I'm pretty sure I'm going to vlog since I did pick up the camera. I'm going to do it again off my phone because it was so easy yesterday just to edit right off my phone and do everything off my phone but for my like sit down videos more than likely i am going to use the computer to edit and want to use my dslr camera um i'm really chilling right now i need to go get something to eat I'm trying to wait for my boyfriend to get out of his meeting so i'm gonna get him something to eat so there's no need for me to go get something to eat he can't eat right now um because he in his meeting and i come back with the food and then this will get cold so i'm just gonna wait I may end up making me noodles depending on how long this meeting takes because your girl is hungry. And then we have to go to Charlotte right after he gets off work. So, yeah, that probably be the time that we end up eating. That's the crazy part. But anyway, um, I'm sitting here doing some stuff now for the website. I'm adding stuff to the website. So, if you don't see anything that you like on the website, I do apologize. But um, I was ready to get it out there. I was so excited. Um, and I am adding plus size to the website, so that will be available soon. I'm just going to make sure that everything that I purchased that I can get from my supplier within a good amount of time. I don't really want to wait a long time, so it was a process it may take a while. And um, what else for the website? Um, I am adding more outfits and things like that more things to the website so you can just let me know what you would like to see on the website and i can get it done for you on um, what you know what you think i should add what you think i should change i'm open to any type of criticism um at this point it doesn't matter to me so um, a lot of people did go show the site some love i didn't get any subs yet but that's okay that's fine you know i feel like getting a lot of activity on the site is very important before i even get any sales because that means someone is someone's people are looking at it and they're going to get the word there as well um, so i'm just going to update and continue to get my inventory up and things like that and then we'll be on the roll um i'm not really bothered about getting sales right now i'm not really bothered about much at this point i'm just doing something that i love and that i've been dreaming about so um and i'm taking it seriously but anyway i'm going to continue to get back to work um, if I was at my desk, I'd just set it up and let y'all watch me, you know, do what I do. But I'm literally sitting at the edge of my bed right now and don't want to move. But anyway, I will, um, talk to you guys in a little bit, okay? I hope you guys can hear me. I hope I was not covering the speaker. So, I look crusty, but I did not come back and vlog yesterday. Um, it's a whole nother day. Today is Friday. Please do not mind my hair. I gotta do it. Um, I had to go to Charlotte last night. Now I went to Charlotte. I went to Greenville. Then I stayed in Greenville. I have showered. I just have not touched my hair. I showered at my mom's house in Greenville. But um, I'm about to chill out. And I'm going to watch on my block for a while. Because I'm tired. And it's raining here. I need to go out and get me a work shirt for tomorrow. Um, but I'll do that later. Probably later on today. Um, and... Let me see, I think, I'm trying to think, I'm going to work on the website probably later on tonight, I'm really just trying to get in a good mind space, good head, mind space um, for um, work tomorrow. So, that being said, um, yeah, I'm just going to chill out for a little while, and I had a long night and get to Greenwood to 2 o'clock in the morning. So I'm still kind of pretty tired. So I'm gonna hopefully I don't fall asleep. I don't need to fall asleep, but I am gonna lay down and chill for a little bit and watch all my blocks. So I'll be back after that. If I go out by myself later, um, to go find a shirt or something, I'll vlog that too, whatever. Cause I know you just guys tired of seeing me just in places and chilling. But um, anyways, I'm just going to 
go ahead and do this and I'll be back. yesterday um i literally chilled watched netflix and then i went to this little sub thing um at saint augustine and so i post some clips of that in there um to try to help that day of vlogging but i really did not do anything and i didn't feel like picking up the camera it was raining trying to get there and then ugh. but anyway I think I'm about to do the, um, I'm sorry, I just got the shower, so I'm in my towel. But I think I'm about to do the vapor rub, um, basically losing weight overnight. My stomach is not that big. I do kind of have like a little pudge, but it's not that big. And I want to see uh, what it would do for me overnight. So I think I'm going to record that for you guys. Um, I just got to... Cause I don't want to do it on my camera since I already got all my footage up here and there's too much type of editing trying to get it over. So, I think I'm going to do that. If I don't do that tonight, I'll do it tomorrow night. More like I'm going to do it tonight because I don't think my boyfriend is staying over here. And he's probably going to sit with me tomorrow. So, I don't want to be smelling like a vapor rub when I lay in the bed with him. So, yeah. So I'm about to put some clothes on real quick and I think I'm going to go ahead and record that for you guys and then I'll do the results in the morning because I don't have to go to work until 1 o'clock. So yeah, so I'll be right back. Okay, so now we're getting into the part where I was telling you guys about where I want to show you how to lose weight overnight. Right now I'm just showing you my little pudge and I'm showing you the essentials that you will need which is Vicks Vapor Rub. And then I'm going to show you the plastic wrap that you would need. Just some general plastic wrap, nothing special. That is Dollar General brand. And also your waist trainer. And then, I don't know what I'm doing now. Oh, I'm taking the plastic wrap out of the uh, thing and unraveling it. This is kind of... I mean, it's not pointless. I went ahead and had it ready to go, so you wouldn't have, so I wouldn't have to worry about it once I got to that point. Sorry if I look rough. I just got out the shower, and kind of sorry for the setup because I'm recording off my uh, cell phone right now, especially for my vlogs. And I was just inputting this into my vlog, so yeah, I don't feel like messing with my camera right now. So now I'm just taking the VIX. I think I should apply a little bit more. I only did two layers and then I did a layer on each side as you will see when I go. But you just rub it all the way around your stomach. If you do have back fat, you can also put it around your back. I don't have back fat so I didn't worry about my back. And then I'm just applying it to the sides, like I said. And if you have a belly button piercing, I took mine out because I had to clean it anyway. But, I mean, I don't know how well, you know, if it was snug with the plastic wrap. So, that was still a good thing that I took it out. And then I'm just wrapping the plastic wrap around me. It's just such an easy task because once you put it at the front like that, you see it stays and then you just start wrapping around. And I think I wrapped around at least twice. And then I went back in because I feel like it wasn't tight enough. But you guys will see that next. And then when it's time to take it off, you can cut it if you want. I just ripped it with my nails. All it's going to do is stick to it anyway, so it doesn't have to be perfect. And then this here is why I decided I was trying to get it off my shirts. So I could have a comfortable night's sleep. And then I felt like it wasn't tight enough. So I'm going to apply, I think, another uh, another wrap around or so. I'm not sure. I can't remember. 
Y'all, I had a sports bra since like middle school, since I was playing volleyball. So please do not judge me. Yes, I know it's too small. I just, that's not my like instinct when I go to the store. Oh, you need a sports bra. But anyway, I need to buy some more. My boyfriend, he gags me all the time about not being, not having a, a sports bra that fits me. So yeah. Hopefully, y'all don't hear me breathing in this thing because I'm doing it on my phone, so I don't feel the need to stop it. And then you got to start recording it all over again. Well, not all over, but got to go to the section that didn't have recorded and just start when I could just talk through the whole thing. So, all right. So, as you can see now, I'm just making sure it looks correct. Uh, make sure it fits you tight. And you can kind of see that I'm already like my stomach is sinking in a little. Just by applying the plaster wrap. So now I'm just going to go ahead and apply my waist trainer. Um, whatever you want to call it. Because it's technically, I don't think it's like actual waist trainer. I got this from Gabe's, I think. Um, but whatever type of waist trainer you have where you consider your waist trainer, you apply it at night. Next I sleep. Okay, so it is the next morning, you guys. And right here, I'm just trying to fix my camera. Um, so, yes, this is the next morning before I had to go to work. You guys, I promise this will burn you for at least 30 minutes while you're laying down in your sleep. It's kind of the most uncomfortable thing, so I kind of let mine wear off before I um, went to sleep. I just like watch some YouTube videos to calm myself, but it was fine. And so now I'm just going to take my waist trainer off. I went and got my scissors. As you can see, it did move throughout the night. Um, my waist trainer didn't have that much sweat on it, but you can still, I still can feel, I felt the, you know, little stretch, sweat, I'm sorry. Things that it did have. Now I'm just going to take my scissors. You can try to unravel it if you want to. But I just went ahead and cut the plastic wrap. And now we're going to see this outcome. Forgive me for my nipples. I'm sorry. All right. Now, as you guys can see, it's not like I wanted it to be. Being that I don't have that much stomach, I thought it would be, um, you know, snatched a little bit more. But that little pudge that I did have, it went in some. So I do see the difference in that. So if I was to do this, I would say every other night. I would not chance doing it every night being that your skin may get irritated because it do burns. But, um... The process does work. I will do another one soon. And I would apply more vapor rub. But these are my results. And I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe. And comment what you want to see. Thank you.